The Senate Democrats have done everything in their power to slow the work of the Senate, while the President continues to take decisive action. Um, just like he promised during the thing. So it's unfortunate the Senate Democrats remain so out of touch with the message that the American people sent this past November. The people want change. President Trump is delivering that change. And the only response from Senate Democrats so far is to try to stall the core functions of our government. I know that I've repeated this every day, but honestly, it's getting a bit ridiculous. The idea that these highly qualified nominees have the votes for their nomination to be endorsed out of committee and get a full vote are being stalled because Democrats are boycotting the committee vote is outrageous. The mere idea that they're not even showing up to hearings is, is truly outrageous. So I'd like to give a special shout out to the folks at C-SPAN for making sure that all of these embarrassing actions by Senate Democrats get the wall-to-wall -wall coverage that they deserve. Voters are going to remember what senators stood in the way of when President Trump, by President Trump trying to install his agency and department heads the next time their name is on a ballot. I don't mean to sound like a broken record, but the numbers don't lie. Sixteen of President Trump's nominees to head major department and agencies are still waiting to be confirmed. At the same time, in 2009, President Obama only had seven of these people waiting confirmation. In 2001, President Bush had all but two.